What's going on everybody? Dominic back here with another new power video. In today's video, which is part three of our Frigate 40 amp solar charge controller series, we'll be going over how to change battery types, what do each of the LED indicators mean, how to set system parameters, and so much more. So let's hop right into the video, shall we? Okay, so now that I've shown you how to hook up your solar panel and your battery to your solar charge controller, Let's take a look at the indicators on the left as well as the LED screen right here. All right, so let's first start here on the left. So these charging modes, the charge controller will automatically uh, go from stage to stage. So you don't have to worry about that. And in terms of battery type, to change it based off of, you know, what battery you're using, whether that's liquid, AGM, gel, or lithium, gonna scroll to the right here. When you see that gear sign right there, go ahead and hold enter for three seconds. So that's for lithium. If you want to change it to liquid, go on to hit to the right. As you can see here, the indicator is popping up. You're going to go AGM, then gel. But since we're using a lithium battery, let's go ahead and change it back here. Go to hit enter. Okay, now this is for your boost. So as you can see here, we're currently in boost mode. So uh, we can just go in and leave that alone. But of course you can change it by using the directional pad right here. You go all the way up right here, so on and so forth. So let's just go ahead and bump it down to 14.4 for now. Enter, and then just like that, you're done for uh, selecting your battery type and uh, the parameters. Now down here, these indicators will only come on if you have a low voltage or a error. If they populate, go ahead and um, reference our user manual for quick troubleshooting. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our customer support team and we can better assist you in that manner. Okay, so right here we have the voltage of the battery that's currently connected, as well as the amps. Now, the only reason they're showing uh, zeros is because uh, there's no sunlight in here right now. Now, the temperature right here is of the charge controller. Now, on the bottom of the charge controller, there's a temperature port right here. So that will uh, measure your battery's temperature if you so choose to use it. Now let's scroll left to look at our solar panel. So you can see our solar panel is putting out 13.2 volts. Um, and if it was in direct sunlight, it would be uh, populating with the number of amps that it's putting out. Now right here, it shows Bluetooth right up top here. In our next video, we will be going through how to set up your parameters, uh, what each value means, and then how to operate the app. All right, everybody, so as we close out this video, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help us out a lot. Also, part four of this video series will be coming out very soon, so hit that notification bell to be notified when it drops. Everybody, this is Dominic from New Power, and I'll see you on the next one.